very, very lucky Cubs, that's all I can say. They were very lucky to have been noticed by Linda and rescued by CJ and Louie. Very, very lucky. You know, when I heard the story about these two Cubs, I thought I have to intervene and I have to offer um, help. So many people, these Cubs are stressed and um, George has dropped his head and I think it's just time, let's get these Cubs out of here. You have your plans and then life takes over. So when Chris said, look, you know, there are these two little lion cubs, just, and I didn't say yes at first. I mean, we're like, okay, we'll think about it and look at it. When you read their story and you hear their story and it's, you know, it's a good cause. It's a worthwhile, a worthwhile thing. For now, it's about getting them settled in, uh, getting them used to people, new surroundings. You know, you can already see they're starting to play and they've now had their first drink, a real drink. So George over here is going to have a checkup with the ophthalmologist later on this month. Going to be looking at his cataracts in his eyes just to see the potential for some surgery on them. Maybe some laser surgery and give him his quality of life back because at the moment he doesn't see that well. A few days after the surgery and it is unbelievable the progress that this line has made. It's naughty little aggressive cat. <laughs> and even uh, Yame had, um, you know, still the remnants of the cataracts on the on the eye. You'd say he's pretty much a healthy cub. George has got a little way to go. Still, you know, little calluses on his paws, and he's got these little wounds on his head. These animals are extremely resilient. Two brothers, yet they're so different in personalities. Uh, Yame is known as the troublemaker, and that he is. Any opportunity, you turn your back on him. Georgie, he's slightly more reserved, he's slightly more shy, he's a little bit more nervous. George just likes to talk. If he doesn't see you, if you're not around, or if his brother's not around, then he's that wow, wow. Whereas Yame is so confident, he doesn't need to. He's just uh, full of beans and full of confidence. George and Yame, who are now 13 months old. I actually can't believe it. Boy, have they grown. So we're gonna be taking uh, George and Yame for a, a walk, and it's an enrichment walk. We do this with all the lines. It's good to start them when they're young like this because when they get older, then this is just a natural occurrence. It's an everyday occurrence for the lions. Yame has just turned into an incredible young lion, and he's got this little mane developing, and uh, Little Georgie, although he battles still with his, his joints um, and his, his back legs, he's on a lot of medication for it. Um, but despite that, he's got a character of note and he's such an adorable little lion. He's got such a loving nature. 